Now, out to Hendrickson, open three for the left wing, in and out. Valentine follow, banks in, and Drexel scores first. Did kind of take an awkward hop on her, bounced off her knee to the sideline. Now Dickie is steal along the perimeter, took it away from Washington, brings it up for herself, weaving her way up the floor, stopping at the foul line, pulled up jumper, good, and Delaware leads it 4-2. to two. Latimer has it on the right wing, they dared her to shoot it, instead she goes high post to battle, right back to Latimer, quarter three, a swish, and China Latimer puts Delaware up four. By eight, O'Leary now gets it on the right block, double comes, her pass is tipped and stolen by Nihil for Drexel. Two minutes left in the half, Delaware trying to harass in the backcourt, Nihil got it up to Hendrickson, got it back, dribbled to the lane and hit the shot. Drexel capitalizes on turnovers. Final minute of this opening quarter. Drexel ball down six. Quick shot. Good. Straight away three. Hannah Nihill pulls Drexel within three. Seven in a row from Drexel. They're within one. Nine seconds left in the quarter. Pressure slowing Delaware down. Skinner brings it ahead. Five seconds left. Step back. Right wing three. Good. Ty Skinner knocks it down and gets a little momentum back for the Blue Heads. On the run, near corner, Johnson. Entry feed goes to O'Leary. Looks opposite wing, Smalls. Buries the triple. And Delaware's up nine. McBride dribbling to the top. Had a whip one through traffic. It was tipped and stolen. Sotna got the deflection. And here comes Drexel. Nihill leaves it inside. Right block layup. Washington gets Drexel off the schneid. The Dragons back within 13. Adamer, but quick in the possession. It's short. Allentine chased down the long rebound. But her outlet taken away by Dickey. Inside to O'Leary. For the layup plus the foul. He's going to get that shot off. There's O'Leary in the high post, lobbing it inside. Great catch from Battle in the high-low gets Delaware two more. He golden opportunities inside to start the second half. Battle trying to take advantage. Nice drive, finger roll, banks home. Pump works her way left wing, deep two front rim, no. Long rebound drab by Bacon. Nihil on the leak out, gets the long outlet, lets the defense clear and lays it home. And it's a single digits game. 45-36. Works her way to the foul line, kicks it back out to Nihil. Nihil goes behind the back with a bounce, goes back door to Leonard, reverse layup, good. Oh, how did she see her cutting to the basket? And it's 49-45. And afterwards, she almost got herself stuck rooting for Drexel at times. It's the entry feed here to Valentine, center of the lane. The freshman puts it home. It's 51-47. to And she also mentioned it with so many games getting postponed and canceled. She said, I wouldn't have minded if that was one that got canceled. <laughs> Skinner creating off the bounce, plus the contact. Hits the shot and a foul. Dribbling to the top of the key, hands it off to... Johnson, Johnson, lobbing it inside. Battle lays it in for the left block. What an assist. That, that could be the assist of the game right there by T. Johnson. They rotated. Battle came over and then Dickey dropped down. But on the inbound, Conley gets it, finishes, and the foul. McBride dribbling down the lane, kicked it out to Dickey. Dickey to the free throw line, gets it inside. Battle goes to the opposite block, and a reverse layup is good. No, rebound battle. Shot clock is off. We'll see if Drexel fouls again. Nihil says, no, wait, I'll steal it, and hits a left wing three. Just as you're about to call it, Nihil won't go away. She's got 32. But inbound to Nihil. She loses handle, gets the shot up. Final buzzer sounds. What a performance by Delaware. As the hands are 12 and 1 of the CAA and 15 and 2 overall, they beat Drexel 68 to 60.